Custom Plumbing, Heating and Air. Nobody wows clients like we do. And some of you might want to stay indoors with the storm coming our way right now at uh, 809. Let's take a look at our weather conditions looking across the county. One thing that's pretty consistent here, that cloud cover that we are seeing from Alpine all the way to downtown. It is a cool start to your morning. Just some light drizzle in some spots throughout the county. That's going to change again, becoming more widespread later on tonight and into tomorrow. As I activate our future cast, you see throughout the afternoon going to be pop up showers. We are going to get breaks in that throughout the day. And then as we look ahead to tomorrow, that's when we're going to be dealing with the rain here throughout the county. That morning commute activating the future cast. You can see for the most part it is going to be wet. So of course our team will be on top of it all morning. So make sure to stay tuned starting at 430. We're also talking about the snow. So we're seeing the pinks and the blue here. The snow is going to develop even at our lower elevations. We could get several inches at the highest elevations like Mount Laguna, Palomar Mountain. But even places like Julian, we could see an inch or two. Second half of the week, we will eventually start to dry out. Still got to get past all of this, though. Wind advisory that goes into effect by this afternoon for our deserts here. Going to see some pretty gusty conditions, and that winter storm warning for our mountains starts this afternoon as well. So some hazardous driving conditions. Right now, our temperatures seeing lots of 40s to 50s. Much colder in the mountains, though. Unfortunately, the mountains really not going to warm up today. Activating our wind gust future cast. You see how strong it's going to get later on this evening. Ocotillo Wells at times gusting near 40 miles per hour, even Mount Lagoon. Julian going to get pretty gusty later on today. Forecast highs for today overall fairly cool and it's going to stay that way over the next couple of days. As far as how much rainfall we could get when all is said and done anywhere between half an inch to an inch here along the coast, maybe a little bit more in our inland valleys and again in our mountains. The snow, that's what we are watching out for. So just watch out if you're going to be driving there because we're not only talking about the snow, also the rain and the wind. Overall, fairly pleasant in our deserts with some of those showers developing throughout the day and tomorrow.